All right, so we built this cool little announcer board with DTMF control, and we're gonna be cutting this repeater off. All right, so we're gonna activate this radio. We're gonna be using channel one, which we've set our, our code to 35. This DTMF relay right here will trip, which will cut this repeater off. This is the signal it's using to know, hey, it was tripped. So you repeater. can see this is going off like it should. It periodically goes off. It's using this part of the relay to come over here, go through this relay, which triggers this little board. Remember, this is a prototype board. I don't know if they ever came out with it or what they did, but we're gonna go ahead and we're going to activate that, which bring you in. UK544 repeater is now offline. Now we're gonna put it back online. Now, all right, now neat little use functions for this would be this repeater ID goes off every hour, top of the hour, or it, it's every hour set. So let's say after six months, that thing, you know, it's not at the top of the hour anymore. It's six, seven minutes past. Well, we can DTMF into it, cut it off, cut it back on. That restarts the clock which means that you know, when we cut it back on at the top of the hour, it'll be beacon off to the top of the hour again. It's gonna always creep one way or the other because it's not keeping track of time, it's just keeping track of a rotating you know, hour clock. Yeah, another cool little neat use function, um, I had a guy tell me you could use it for a tornado siren. You know, you could remotely control that. Um, we have a couple gates on our farm, they all use DTMF tones. If you sit there and listen to, I believe it was the MERS frequencies, when we hit the little button in our vehicle to open the gate, you'll hear a quick and that is your DTMF tones telling the gate to unlock. So you could technically build one yourself using uh, radios. So, neat little thing, works for amateur radio, works for GMRS, I would work for really anything as long as you can find two radios or find at least one radio to program it into it. The announcer, that's just something a little extra you could have, but it's kind of nice. It's been working great, you know, no issues with it. I'll show it to you one more time. Like I said, going to this radio, we're going to activate 35. Bring you into the relay. Repeater's off. The WRUJ544 repeater is now offline. Now, we're going to bring you over here. We're going to cut it back on. Back on. This is going to go off. This is the Purgatory Mountain GMRS repeater. Whole unit's working pretty well.